Hey guys, what's up? Ashley here. I'm saying number 356 of daily blogging. Um, we're really like coming to an end here. It's December 26th. The year is almost over. I can't believe it. Um, so it's time to look forward to next year. Also to reflect back on the year that was. So I guess like these next few videos will be just that <laughs> a little of both. <laughs> I mean, like, like, um, like one day will be one thing. Another day will be another thing. Not like everything in the same video, even though I have been known to do that from time to time. <laughs> um, so sorry. Oh no. Oh no. My tablet is reminding me of a calendar item for tomorrow, but I didn't need it up. <laughs> So what I wanted to talk about today is last week, um, well, it says five days ago, <laughs> um, Moon Omens, you know, I love them. Moon Omens on Instagram posted a things to look forward to in 2022 based on your sign. Um, like I'm an earth sign. So this applies to all Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn all other earth signs. <laughs> um, but you can check out moon omens to find your own if you're not an earth sign. Like you could be if you're a water or a, or a fire or an air. So they have all the things on there on the moon omens Instagram. So <laughs> this is what they say that I have to look forward to in 22. Um, so the first item is time freedom being a reward of your working smarter, of you working smarter. So I guess I'll just have more time <laughs> if I do my job better. <laughs> Work smarter, not harder. I'm always looking for ways to um, get more done in less time. The easiest path. <laughs> the, the most results with the easiest path. <laughs> Um, I'm good at that. Um, so the second one says exploring new hobbies and opportunities that will become life passions and give you lifelong friends. Yay. <laughs> um, one of the things that I am looking forward to doing in 2022 is to up my friend game. <laughs> I don't think that I'm very good at it. And, um, I definitely have a lot of room for improvement with staying in contact with people and reaching out. And um, I mean, most of the time, I mean, for the most part, my problem is that I feel like I'm annoying or a bother. So then I just kind of retreat back into myself and don't really reach out. But um, I want to work on that and I want to be a better friend and I want to show people that I care. So I don't know what these new hobbies could be because the the few hobbies that I have are already very expensive and I don't think that I can I don't think that I can add another one on <laughs> but I think that I mean I can take this to be expanding on my friendships that I've started making within my niche groups you know um so yay that's that's promising <laughs> Um, decisive financial decisions and investments. Good, because who doesn't want more money? I know I do. <laughs> um, many cozy and comfy nights in at home. Yes, please. My favorite. I love that. <laughs> I love staying on my couch and snuggling under my blankie and watching all the TV. <laughs> Oh, sleeping in, in the, on the weekends. That's also fantastic, even though that's morning and not nighttime. <laughs> but I mean, I could stay up all night if I could. <laughs> I mean, like if I didn't have to wake up in the morning, I would stay up all night. A hundred percent. Like, I love it. <laughs> I love the nighttime. I like come alive at night. I'm like, Ooh, what else can I do now? I'm like, Oh, I have to go to sleep because I have to wake up in the morning but I don't want to go to sleep. You know, I'd rather sleep in the morning. <laughs> oh, I'm 
it's like nighttime comes and I'm like, hey, <laughs> I'll be tired all day. And then night I'm like, why do I? <laughs> um, so, yes, I like cozy, comfy and cozy nights in like the Christmas song. <laughs> oh, I love Christmas. Okay. Um, and lastly, which I'm most excited about and I most hope that comes true, <laughs> is a romantic relationship that is rooted in mutual, genuine connection, love, trust, and security. Please date me. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> yeah. So, man, if that comes true in 22... I will just be the happiest little, the happiest little person ever. <laughs> Why do I like to, I always cover my face when like I say something embarrassing. <laughs> but it's true. <sighs> That's like all I've ever wanted in my entire life. <laughs> Don't cry. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's like the only thing I ever want for Christmas and it never happens and like. You know, I don't want to be sad. I'm hopeful. I'm a hopeful person. I'm going to be hopeful right now. <laughs> this one, this last one, this one here. It, oh, shoot. Oh, there. <laughs> it's going to happen. A romantic. I can't read backwards. <laughs> but you know what I mean. You could read it. <sighs> Rooted in mutual, genuine connection, love, trust, and security. Yes. Mutual is the key word there because like, I don't want another situation that I am more invested in than he is. And I can't handle that. I don't, I don't want it again. I just can't do it. And, and I just, I, just once just one time that's all you need is one person one person to love you back to mutually love you and it's just really hard to find it's like it's like uh once in a life twice in a million those are the words right i don't know whatever uh, but we're going to be very hopeful going into 22 and 2, 20, 20, to 22, 22, like Taylor Swift. Um, and I'm going to, I'm going to play the Taylor Swift song because that makes most sense at midnight because how can you not? Because do you see what happened when we didn't have Barbara Walters saying welcome to 2020? Like this is 2020. We didn't have it. No one, no one called her up. Where was she? And look what happened. Bad things only in 2020. So, I mean, if you don't play the obvious 2022 song, then it's your own fault if bad things happen in 2022. <laughs> because I'll be playing it. I mean, I'm not even a huge Taylor fan, but I'm going to play it. 22. So, yeah, here I am. Things to look forward to in 22, Earth Signs. So if you're an Earth Sign and you're single, good things are coming. That's what it says. <laughs> so yay. Um, all right. I'm going to go now. <laughs> I've rambled too long. But I'll be back tomorrow. Love you. Bye. <laughs>